Hi, in this tutorial, I'll talk about implementing pagination using Query Builder Query. If you go to any site and you search something, the whole result set is not displayed at once. A particular number of results displayed on a multiple pages. So on first page, they display number of results. And when you go to the next page, the next number of results are displayed. There are a number of ways to implementing that. But as part of this tutorial, I'll talk how you can implement pagination using Query Builder Query itself. So as part of this, I'll show you searching assets in Vretail. So our site AMGeeks does not have enough assets. So I'm using Vretail. So if I search this, uh, all the assets in Vretail, you see 256 results has been there and it is showing the 10 results by default. So when you every time you hit it, it will show you the first 10 result itself. It will not show you the another result. So for that, we can change the number of results you want to see. So if I add p dot limit is equal to minus one, it will show you the whole result. But that we do not need. We need the results in on pages. So for what that I can say, okay, let me show you p limit is equal to 20. That means it will show you the 20 results. But the problem is again, it will keep showing you 20 results every time, the first 20 results. So to now you should know, your query should know from where it it should display these 20 results for that there is another one available called p dot offset okay that offset is defined from where these 20 results should be you know display so i'm saying p uh, dot offset is equal to zero that means the 20 results will display starting from the zeroth result means first result okay so for that you can define suppose you on a particular page you want to display 20 results so for the p dot limit you can set 20 or you want to show the 30 results then set it 30 and p dot offset is used to define from where it will show you results so let's say the first 20 results are there if i want to show you the next 20 results means results from 21 to 40 so what you can do in offset define 20 now that new 20 results has been displayed and if you say okay this is my second page now i want to display the third 20 results means 41 to 60 so you can define like 40 so the results will be start from 41 because it, it's a index based right 40 means 40 41 result so that way you can show here right how from where you want to display so if you check here if i have 256 results and each page I want display 20 results on each page so that means there will be a 13 pages right 13 pages so I will keep changing this offset to show you next results mean next page results so how will you calculate this offset in actual environment suppose I have 13 pages so I'll send the page number from the front end means the uh, UI and either you can send the index or you can send the page number it's up to you let's say I'm sending the page number so how will you calculate offset suppose I sent a page number and what I'll do in this I'll make minus one in case you are sending the page number you can set the index so for the first page you can send zero but if you're not sending zero let's say you are saying page number so you will multiply this with this limit 20 right so 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 and multiply 20 so it says a 0 so that means here in offset you can pass on 0 right next time you will be passing 2 I mean this second page number and you will be 20 multiply by 1 it will be 20 so next time your offset will be 20 so for next next page same way you will be keep calculating and you will be passing the page number from the front end or the UI and it will keep giving you a results as per the page each time you hit from this UI. Now there is a one more case, use case. Suppose you are saying, okay, I need first 20 results. Even you need first 20 results, still it is searching for whole results, whatever the number of results you have. So it's an unnecessary burden on your AEM or the searching, right? So suppose right now we have only less number of uh, assets or the results. Suppose you have millions of assets or millions of results. In that case, just to show you few number of the result, it is searching whole repository and the millions of record which is very costly so in that case rather than search whole thing there is a way you can search a limited number of results just to show you uh, which are sufficient to make this you know available like offset and limit so for that 
they there is something available called guest uh, guest total so i did guest total so before i run this query first let's understand let's open this in json so you will see here success total results are 256 and results is showing 20 and more is equal to false that means uh, it 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 iterated whole results right rather than it it need to display only 20 results still it iterate whole results so now if i add p dot guess total is equal to true and if i search it change it here right now it is showing 256 results means whatever the results we have if i search here it shows 20 results but here it is showing 20 plus results are available right now it did not tell you like how many results you have so if you add guess total is going to true it will iterate only results which are sufficient to show you this right limit and offset so if i say here right now you will be seeing 20 plus it is saying okay 20 results but there are more than 20 results available if you come here and open this json query builder again you will be seeing the results are 20 and total are 20 rather than in earlier case it was showing total is equal to 256 results and more is equal to false but now it is saying more is equal to true that means the more results are available okay but let me add a one more time let me add 20 that means the second page if i hit right now it now is saying okay i'm saying uh, showing 20 but there are more than 40 results available Be as part of first two pages it iterated 40 right for the two pages but it's saying there are number more number of results available but right now you don't know how many results are there right so in that case it is not iterating whole repository it is iterating only the result required to show uh, here as per the search if you open again and you come here you will be seeing now it is showing the total results are 40 means the two pages has been iterated and the results are 20 and more results still the more are true but here the problem is suppose you want to generate the page number as well in your front end right now you don't know how many results you have based on results you will generate the pagination so but if you go to any of the site for few pages they show the numbers and rest of the uh, pages they have next or previous so what you can define you can instruct this query okay at least give me this much of result so that i can display number of pages say uh, suppose in that case you want to display at least five number one to five and for the rest of the pages you say next so for that you can instruct okay at least give me 100 results so that i can display five pages if you hit here it will saying okay they am giving you 100 results but there are more than 100 results available so that means now dynamically you can you know display five pages say 20 uh, each 20 on each pages that means the five pages so you can generate five uh, numbers for, for the page numbers okay and if you check here it is showing results 20 and total results is showing now 100 means it iterated 100 results for five pages directly and more results are true let's say i want to display the last page so what will you do i have a 13th page minus one into my limit 20 so what will show you 240 so if i put 240 in offset it will give me the last page means the last results so so if you display the last page means 240 starting from 240 it will showing okay the total page has been 256 because this page will display only 16 pages and you don't see any plus sign here means the all the results has been iterated so if i open again this json query builder now you will see the total results has been come and more is equal to false that means more results are not available on offset the whole information is here in coming tutorial i'll show you the exactly same thing by implementing through the ui how you you know create whole component where you can give input from using front end and this query will give you result as per the page so i hope you understood this query and how you can implement pagination if you have any question please do comment thank you